In the vast ocean of e-commerce, two business models are making waves, dropshipping and print-on-demand. Let's start with dropshipping. Picture this, you're a retailer but your store doesn't have piles of products gathering dust. Instead, when someone buys a product from you, you purchase it from a third party, who then ships it straight to the customer. You never see or handle the product. That's dropshipping in a nutshell. Now, let's talk about print-on-demand. Imagine you're selling custom t-shirts. But instead of having a warehouse filled with every size, color, and design, you only print a shirt when someone places an order. This model saves you from the headaches of inventory management and storage space. These models seem simple enough, right? But as with everything in life, there's more than meets the eye. Now that you have a basic understanding of these models, let's dive deeper into their pros and cons. Dropshipping on the surface seems like a no-brainer, but let's peel back the layers to reveal its pros and cons. Firstly, the advantages. With dropshipping, the startup costs are incredibly low. You won't need to invest in product inventory, thus reducing your initial capital requirements. Moreover, setting up a dropshipping business can be a breeze, especially if you're using an established platform. You can literally get started in a matter of hours. Another big advantage is the flexibility in location. Because you're not tied to a physical inventory, you can run your business from anywhere with an internet connection. What's more, dropshipping gives you access to a wide variety of products. You're not limited to selling what you can make or store. If your supplier stocks it, you can sell it. But, it's not all rosy. Dropshipping does have its downsides. One of the biggest issues is the relatively low profit margins. Because you're not manufacturing or storing the products, you're essentially a middleman, which can eat into your profits. Inventory issues and supplier errors can also be a headache. If your supplier runs out of stock or makes a mistake, it's your reputation on the line. And let's not forget about customer service challenges. When things go wrong, you'll be the one dealing with unhappy customers, even if the fault lies with your supplier. So, dropshipping offers flexibility and ease, but it's not without its challenges. If you like this video, please subscribe to this channel and click the bell to be notified every time we release a new video. Now let's turn our attention to print on demand. It's a different beast, but is it the right one for you? Print on demand is a modern marvel in the e-commerce space, and it's adored for a multitude of reasons. One of the biggest benefits is the minimal initial investment. You only pay for what you sell, meaning you don't have to buy an inventory up front. This also eliminates the hassle of inventory management, freeing your time to focus on marketing and scaling your business. Another major advantage of print on demand is the ability to easily customize products. This gives you the freedom to experiment with designs and products without any financial risk. Moreover, the high profit potential is undeniable. With the right product and marketing, you can enjoy healthy margins. However, like every business model, print on demand has its own set of challenges. A significant drawback is the lack of control over shipping. You are at the mercy of your supplier's shipping times which can frustrate customers. Furthermore, the quality of products is largely dependent on your supplier so choosing a reputable one is crucial. Limited product choices can also be a downside, as you can only sell what your supplier offers. Additionally, the cost per item is typically higher compared to bulk buying, which can potentially eat into your profits. Print on demand offers customization and minimal risk, but it also has its share of drawbacks. Now, the million dollar question, drop shipping or print on demand? After this dive into both e-commerce models, it's clear that each has its unique strengths and weaknesses. If you're someone who's just starting, looking to invest a modest amount and have a passion for personalizing products, print on demand could be your golden ticket. It allows you to exercise your creativity and build a brand that truly reflects your vision. On the other hand, if you're attracted to a vast product portfolio and aren't deterred by the challenges of managing supplier relationships, dropshipping might be your pathway to online success. It offers the possibility of scaling up quickly, especially if you're strategic about choosing products that are in high demand. Remember, the right model depends on your individual circumstances and goals. Choose wisely, and you'll be well on your way to e-commerce success. So, take the time to weigh your options and let your entrepreneurial journey begin. Thanks for watching.